No one artist made more of an impact than a guy from my hometown, this Oaktown native. Uh-oh, uh-oh, all that. He brought a lot to the game, too, you know what I'm saying, the dancing. That was real big, because, you know, hip-hop was just known for lyrically and lyrically and lyrically. He put the, he put the dance in at the party to where the girls wanted to be a part of it. People might dog him now, but you had your set of Hammer fans. Don't even act like it, you know, with the sad. Because when you did that, like, MC Hammer look move and wiggle and go over to the side, everybody did that. Hammer was hot. I definitely have the utmost respect for Hammer. He was a young cat that came in the game, did his own thing, did it the way he wanted to do it, and uh, he succeeded. Hammer was the first puffer. You know what I'm saying? As far as, like, commanding... Uh, like that big pop success over like the world. You can't touch this. You can't touch this. Oh man, I knew that was Bold. gonna be one of the hugest records ever in hip hop, rock and roll, pop you in the country. About him, right? <laughs> it's like you can't touch this. <laughs> Hammer was raw dog. He did his thing. I, I actually used to like him. I mean, for real time, on the real tip. Hammer's videos with their outlandish sets, special effects, costumes, and dancers prove that rap music could stand next to its rock and pop counterparts on MTV. Stop. Hammer time. Hammer did a lot for MTV. I know a lot of people was watching MTV during the Hammer days. Those videos were unbelievable. I would run to see a Hammer video. If I heard, can't touch this couple. Sure, I remember when we used to be on flying the, to the TV. On the road with him, remember? Hammer was explosive. Yes, it's hard to follow him. He know what to dance and the whole thing. Like a circus <laughs> on stage. <laughs> You have like four different things going on. You got a choir over here doing their stuff. Oak Town 357 doing their stuff. He doing the stuff. He got some guys over here doing the stuff. And he just kept you like this the whole time. For me, he, he like showed me what uh, a real entertainer is. And I hope that he knows that he touched people like me because I found a, a lot of respect to him for what he did. Hammer was big, I mean, what? Can't hate on a man like that. You can't hate on him. One way he was like Hammer the dancer, the entertainment megastar. And he came back because everybody started talking about how he sold out and everything. He tried to come back hard Gosh. with the with the Nah, he came back gangster first though. Remember okay, with, the, okay. with, with, with the skull cap and the lopes on. He was he had that on the pumps and the too legit. Yeah, too legit. Too legit. Quick. He came back. He should have did just do what you do. Whatever they say about you. For real. Well, just do your thing. I didn't like him, you know. Um, I didn't, of course, I didn't like Vanilla Ice, and I, I put them both in the same category. Most of the kids were into Hammer, and I was just like, I remember I used to just be like, why do you listen to this bullshit? Most of the kids were into Hammer, and I was just like, I remember I used to just be like, why do you listen to this bullshit? People be talking, you know, talking shit about Hammer, but run up on it. Hammer beat your I ass. I bet you'll beat your mouth. Hammer your mouth ass. <laughs> run up on Hammer. For real.